We on? Yep. Welcome, ah, we're welcome. High. We're hot. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the private hot. screening premiere of WDED Dead in the Move in the Morning. This is an awesome, awesome event here. I have the director, the producer, and the I, third I, I, thing. I wrote it. I wrote it. And, too. and the writer here, Mr. Maurice Jovan. Maurice Jovan, how was it working with me? Horrible. <laughs> so let me tell you that. Like, Next question. <laughs> really? So. Next question. What is the plan for this movie? What do you What do you expect to see out of this? Uh, people on screen. Next right. question. All right. So, so now, when the movie starts, how is it to you? It's going to go from the beginning to end. Next question. <laughs> All right. So this is, ladies and gentlemen, this is Maurice Jovan. He I is am the not him. He is the writer, director, <laughs> promoter, promoter. He does it all, okay? This is the guy who's been working producer, on this. You forgot producer. How many years have you been working on this? Uh, I, two days. How did you prepare for the naked sex scene? I didn't. All right, ladies and gentlemen, once again, this is Mar Maurice Jovan. How you going to interview me and you don't even know my name? <laughs> <laughs> Worst interview ever. I hope the movie is better. The movie is coming out. You will enjoy it. Thank you again for coming on the red carpet. Yeah, whatever. I'm Spike on the mic, and we're here on the set of the private hold screening on, of WDED, -E the movie. Hold on real quick. Hold on real quick. Dude, we, we're, we're doing this. Over. We got to start this over. Can you get some pictures of me in this uh, momentous occasion, please? Yes, of course. You know, there's not many times you get to see, uh, you know, a movie. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here on the private screening with one of the actors, one of the lead actors here, Mr. SBK, Soul Brother Kevin. I don't know his real name, so we just call him that. You don't know my real name. SBK, how'd you get involved in the movie? Um, Mo, when we met, he said, I have a script for you. And I go, for what? He goes, a movie that I wrote. And I said, well, I'm looking for a kidney. Uh, I was in kidney failure, and I was looking for a kidney. I said, after I have my transplant, we'll talk about a movie, if I make it. So you were the holdup in this, because we supposed to shot this no, two no, years no, ago. No, 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 no. I was not the holdup. I was in recovery, and then I made it. I made it from death to be in a dead movie. All right, so question one, I, question one to know, would you ever work with Mo again? I have to work with him, unfortunately, every day. I'll be working with him tomorrow. He'll probably call in sick, but I, it's, it's okay, I expect it. And it's President's Day. Shout out to all the presidents except for the current one. And maybe, there's a whole bunch of them, but like, shout out to Obama. Yeah. All right, a couple more questions here. Boxers or briefs? To the director. Boxers or briefs? English. We ain't doing that. <laughs> okay. Right. And a couple more questions. Yeah. How did you prepare for the love naked sex scene? You said one more question. A couple of more questions. How yeah. much you getting paid to do this? It's not about the money. How much you got paid? What's this about? Uh, I got a contract. Spike on the mic. That's what we promote here. <laughs> and spike on the mic and man titties. Yeah, really. All right, so how did you prepare for the love sex scene? The love sex scene that was cut? Yeah. That's because hot sauce can't find no love, not even in the apocalypse. And the last question, I really want to know. I was, supposed to, I was supposed to hunch. I was ready to hunch. I came ready. I had a love scene. Oh, you did? I did, and I came ready. I had a mouthwash. I did some push-ups. And that's that day I had wore that man girl. Remember right, what I right, told you? Yeah, I was yeah. all tight. I was like, I hope we do it today. I hope we do it. Uh, but it, we didn't do it. And then... Uh, well, you probably, you probably would have looked good naked and oiled up. I think Mo is jealous that my acting was better than his directing. Now, that's deep. But you'll see what I'm... You know what I mean. But yeah. the people don't know. Right. Well, here's what I'm saying. Like I'm saying, being that you're an actor, I got to know this. Why do moss grow on trees? I'm not an actor. I'm, I'm a radio personality. But you act in this movie. I act, well, okay. I act like a radio personality in real life. So it was an easy transition. Oh. To act like one. And I know a lot of zombies. Oh, I'm sorry. Allegedly. <laughs> All right, hold on a second. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Spike on the mic. We're on the private screen at WDED, Dead in the Morning. This is my man, SBK. Hey, hey, I'm on the show on Friday. Three, two, one, go. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> bye. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Carl Remy. Yes, yes. He is one of the stars in this motion picture, WDED, Dead in the Morning. So, Carl, let me ask you about this. How did you get involved into this project? Well, I'm a good friend of Moe's from stand-up comedy. We're both comedians. Y'all doing there something? Yeah, oh, yeah, man. Yeah. My bad. <laughs> and and Mo begged me to be on this thing, and I was like, I don't want to do your piece of junk film. Really? And uh, <laughs> so no, uh, no. How, how long have you been involved in this? Well, since the beginning, uh, I guess the process of he he called me up. He's like, Hey, Carl, man, I got this cool little fun script. 
We were eventually we were supposed to do a short, and then it turned into this. We right. shot one day for the proof of concept. We're gonna do a proof of concept. Shot that one day. Right. And then he's like, you know what? We're gonna shoot the feature, and I already committed. So I was like, I guess I'm on board for the whole ride. All right. So people want to know how is it working with Maurice Jovan? Man, I love Mo. That's that's all I gotta say. All right. And our second question, people want to know: boxers or briefs? None. <laughs> and the third question, before I let you go. How was it preparing for the love, sex, naked scene? We got the right film. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this, this is Carl Remy. He's one of the stars of WDED, Dead in the Morning. And I'm with one of the talented actors that's in the movie. This is? Elena Clare. Elena Clare. How did you get involved into this movie? Well, she I slept first... with the director. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you have to tell them? I yeah, thought it was really. our secret, but I guess it's out now. <laughs> I, I, I'll blur him out. <laughs> Uh, I met Maurice uh, a while back, and I was in his other film, The Purgators, and we stayed connected ever since. All right, so let me ask you this. Would you ever work with him again? Of course, of course. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and, and, and another question there. How did you prepare for the naked sex scene? Why are you revealing it? <laughs> no, giving, the whole, giving the whole movie away. <laughs> you are. <laughs> All, right. All, right. All right, so and the last question. Or maybe the next to the last question. Are you excited about seeing this movie, and what do you expect to see in it? I am very excited. Um, I expect everyone to crack up. It's going to be a great, great movie. And one more time, two questions left. Boxers or briefs? Briefs, for sure. Maybe. And, go ahead, go ahead. And the last question, how do you get rid of fire ants? <laughs> Shake it off. Ladies and gentlemen, Spike on the mic. I'm here with Elena. We're in the screening of private screening of WDED Dead in the Morning. Thank you. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the screening of the WDED Dead in the Morning. I'm out here with one of the premier actors in the movie. His name is Gio. Yeah, G G G G oh, man. Jeez, what are you doing, bro? Like, what is? Yeah. Is your first time here? What's going on? Yeah, so, Gio, how did you get involved in this project? Well, I used to work with Mo on uh, the BDRS on 1025 The Bone for a while. Right. And he said, listen. I'm making this movie. I said, no way in hell. You're not making this movie. Dude, there's no chance in hell. And I said, if you make the movie, dude, you got to put me in the movie. Oh, so you and, and here I am. All right, all right. So what do you expect to get, to, I mean, to see in this movie? What do I expect to see? Really, what I'm waiting to see is a paycheck. That hasn't happened yet. For some reason, I've noticed that there's no paycheck. There's been no monetary compensation. That's what I'm really looking for today. But no, I'm I'm very excited. I think um, I'm hoping for a lot of laughs, man. It was during the movie. It was uh, we laughed a lot. A lot of funny stuff on the set during the, sh the shooting, and I'm looking forward to it. All right, two quick questions, and the people want to know: boxers or briefs? Oh, nothing. Neither. And, neither. That's the question. Neither. And the second, those another question. How did you prepare for the love, naked sex scene? Listen, you know, when you go into something like that, as an actor, which I am, you just have to visualize going into it how it's going to be. No crunches, no workouts? No, there's nothing you can do. You just got to show up on set day of and be ready to go. All right. And since you're an actor, you should be ready for spontaneous questions. Give me the definition of Moss. The def Randy Moss? The, be the football player? Hall of Famer. No, the Moss is in a tree. Oh, I got nothing for that. Right, nothing. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. This again, this, this is Gio. He is one of the actors in WDED, Dead in the Morning. God, I can't talk. And we're here with one of the actors here, Mr. John, the man sinning. John, how did you get involved in this movie? I have no idea. Uh, you know, I think I begged Mo enough times that one day, and I think somebody didn't show up. I think that's really what it came <laughs> down to. Somebody canceled, so last minute I was able to weasel my way in. All right, so we also have a lot of burning questions that people want to know. Boxers or briefs? Uh, I'm a boxer brief guy, so I like I like a little bit of... Hold on, you go both ways? Well, yeah, yeah, I like a little bit of room, but I also like it to keep everything nice and tight. All right. And so who is this lovely lady here that I'm squeezing on? Uh, yeah, you are very tansy, just so you know, Spike is, is getting his money's worth today. Uh, this is my fiance, Danielle. Uh, Danielle, how you doing? I'm great. Are you, are you excited about this movie? I'm so excited. I've been telling him all day, I'm like, I just can't wait to go see it. I mean, I've been waiting for... for the premiere for quite some time now, so right. I'm very excited. All right. so, 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 John, how did you prepare for the naked sex scene? Um, you know, uh, a lot of lotion. You know, I just wanted to make sure that my full body was moisturized, and uh, that, that's my only secret. Right. And the last question that the people wanted to know, how do you get rid of fire ants? Vinegar. I got to ask this question here. Are you in the movie? Maybe. So, how so how did you prepare for the love, sex, naked scene? 
Uh, well, in my normal life, I don't get any of that, so I was very excited for it. So I just really, whatever they told me to do, I was like, I'll do it. Right. So we don't know whether you're in the movie or not. So why are you here? I'm here to support Mo, of course. Oh, and yeah. it's my quota to be hanging out with like three or four black guys for the whole month. So. Is, is it still Black History Month? It is, yeah, all oh, the way. Oh. And it's leap year, so you guys get an extra day. Oh, yo, oh thank yeah. you. All right, well, then, in case you are in the movie, let me ask you this question. Would you ever work with Mo again? Uh, of course I would, yes. It was fun. We, we loved to bust Mo's balls and stuff, but it was a great time. I hope it turned out great. I think what we did looked good, so I'm sure the whole thing's going to be awesome. Oh, did you hear what he said, ladies oh! and gentlemen? He just gave away. I think he might be in the credits. I might be. I might be. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, Spike and the Mike, I'm here with Galvin. You can hear him every morning when? Uh, every weekday morning from 6 to 10 on 102.5 The Bone, the Mike Kelta Show. Thank you. We out. Worst interview ever. I hope the movie is better.